Yangel Herrera returns to New York City on the back of a remarkable spell at the U20 World Cup in South Korea, captaining Venezuela to an unprecedented runners-up spot at the tournament. Herrera earned the Bronze Ball Award as he was recognised as the competition's third best player. The 19-year-old played every minute of the competition for the Vino Tinto in the heart of midfield and earned rave reviews for his commanding performances. Venezuela opened the competition up with a surprise 2-0 triumph over Germany, kicking off the tournament in style. A 7-0 win over Vanuatu followed before they signed off on group play with a hard-fought 1-0 victory against Mexico in Suwon. At place in the last 16 assured, Herrera led his team to the quarter-finals by scoring the only goal in a 1-0 extra-time victory over Japan, a towering header from Ronaldo Lacina corner in the 108th minute. Through to the quarter-finals, Herrera was a pivotal member of the Venezuelan side who overcame his adopted homeland, the United States, in the last eight. Yangel's men dispatched Tab Ramos' talented Stars and Stripes side with two goals and extra time on their way to a 2-1 win. Venezuela, who had finished in third place in the South American Youth Championships earlier in the year, ensured they went one better this time around by defeating Uruguay. The on-loan NYCFC midfielder played the 120 minutes and scored the final penalty in the shootout to send his nation to a first-ever U20 World Cup final. England ran out victorious in a tight, evenly contested final settled by Dominic Calvert-Lewin's goal for the Three Lions, but Yangel and his teammates had already secured their place in Venezuelan soccer folklore and brought hope to a nation. Thank you.